we've got is a whole selection here of, of different stouts and porters at whole varying different ABV levels. Mm -hmm. We're all labelled up with numbers, no branding, so we're going to get a good old feel for, concentrate on the flavours and aromas. Almost peaty characteristic to mm -hmm. it, just on the aroma. And the chocolate malt comes through, the roast cap. Chocolate comes. does come through yeah. very strongly. Yeah. I tell you, that's quite, um, <clears throat> that's, um, that's uh, surprisingly Moorish, that, that is mm. actually, oh, it's getting the old saliva going, that is, yeah. it really is. It's like, mm, very nice. Very good. Very full of flavour. I'm not quite sure what kind of beer we're going to have in there by then. We've, we've the perfect one for us, yeah, it'd be, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And you see, same lovely strong colour. Mm -hmm. Higher ABV. That's got a much more intense um, nose to it, that one. To taste, I think it's nice. Mm. That, that, but to that, drink, that I'm, much, that yeah, much is all I'm not sure I want to drink it. That, that's my only challenge. It's a very bit sickly, yeah. I think, after a while. It's a little bit darker, it's a little bit thicker in terms yeah. of its uh, texture and, 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 and everything, uh, even though it's, you know, it's, it's not quite as strong. Mm. Yeah. So, you... that, there's, there's our starter and there's our extremes. Yeah. In effect, your, your stouts and your porters. Right, this is a 6%, so... Oh, this is uh, not quite as dark by any means, that one. That's a, almost... That's almost brown. Yeah, it's almost. A, it's almost yeah, you're right. It's, it's got a like a dark brown to it, isn't it? Yeah. Oh wow, nutty. It's nice. It's not it's what we want. Not what we want. It's not, <laughs> you know, there, there's, I can't get enthusiastic over that. No. Oh, there you go. Smash it. Again, it's. It's got more alcohol in, so that 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 does change the complexity mm. of the flavour. Guessing is, looking at it, oh, that is black. That's pretty. Yeah. Uh, that's that's. that's. Mm -hmm. mm, that's quite quite a fruity little little start. Quite a nice ruby mm. rubyish sort of. Oh, wow. Oh. There's a lot of... Um, oh, my word, yeah. There's a lot of complexity there. A lot of zing in there, isn't there? Yeah. For the alcohol content, that genuinely sits mm. pretty I, much I think halfway it, between... It does, yeah. That's pretty intense. Yeah. I mean... I'm not sure if I'd have another one, to be honest with you. The true pub, and a lot of effort went into making a beer that was drinkable. Yeah. You know, it's, uh, that was one of the keys that we had yeah. to make something drinkable. Right, let's try. Um... <coughs> right, this is a six percent. So, okay, it's nice it's, and clear. Yeah, it's more yeah, the red clear. and the brown again. Yeah. Red and the black. It's a good name for beer. That's it, it's good then for beer. <laughs> Solved. Interestingly, the hops are coming through. Oh, it feels wonderful in the mouth. Oh. Mm. It's not a stout. Oh. oh. That's a long fire in Stilton, that, isn't it? It is. It absolutely, exactly what I'll be, exactly what I'll be having at Christmas. It, it's not sweet intensity, but the mouthful is full. Six and seven have come out very well. Um, Which are more towards the porter and less yeah. towards the traditional stout. Yeah, more, more, more towards, uh, uh, well, we're looking at a hoppy porter. Yeah. Or a not excessively hoppy porter, but, but uh, I'm, I'm tending towards number six as being more the, 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 the baseline with just a slightly extended alcohol content. Yeah. I think that's what I'm as well. I agree with you. I think it's really nice to have a porter type style with a hot character to it. Yeah. I see what you said there. Oh, it's good though. Mm, it is really lovely and warming, isn't it? <laughs>